Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. We just got the attack from Mars built up and uh, we're gonna do a power up, first, first power up, first gameplay and uh, let you know our initial, initial thoughts. So, turn it on Lily. Yeah, peel off the film. Got it. And the film on the on the DMD as well. Take a look. Go um, let's have a look at the attack from Mars first. There we go. Just while Lily's playing, just a couple of initial thoughts. First of all, just like the Star Wars and the Marvel, the build quality is excellent. Uh, nice, sturdy, heavy unit. Um, despite the box being in pretty bad shape, there's no damage on it whatsoever. Love the artwork on the side. Love the fact it comes around the front. Um, the backboard, I know some people had said wasn't that good. I think it looks awesome. If I'm being super critical though, I would say that the side art is a little pixelated, not quite, not quite up to the standard I would expect, certainly not as good as Marvel and Star Wars, but you know, certainly no big deal for a $600 pinball. Um, but yeah, let's just take a quick look at the, uh, the graphics. Pretty good to me, I've not played it yet. Lily's initial thought, not as good as Star Wars and Marvel. Obviously these tables are completely different. Um, we'll be doing a full review in the next couple of days. Initial thoughts at least, this is a great purchase. Great addition to the arcade room. Um, the games, the tables on here, completely different to Star Wars and Marvel. Definitely more suited to more of an adult audience, I would say, just because of the difficulty level. Um, but, uh, you know, do check back soon. We will be doing a full review, gameplay from all of the tables. In the meantime, happy gaming.